An East Tennessee community grieving the loss of a friend and neighbor three days after a fiery crash. Friends in the funeral home where he worked say Josh Scott is one of the three people killed. The exact sequence of events is still under investigation, but here's what we know from the account given by the Tennessee Constables Association. Saturday afternoon, a constable was called out to a report of a truck driving recklessly in the Sharps Chapel area, believed to have hit a tree and a mailbox. The constable passed the truck on Sharps Chapel Road and then found it stopped in a parking lot near Palmer's Junction Road. As the constable got out, the truck then allegedly sped off toward Highway 33. The constable next spotted the truck as it was crashing into a van on the north end of the Veterans Memorial Bridge over the Clinch River, with the burning wreckage going airborne over the side. Now, people who knew Josh Scott say he was one of the victims in that crash. Tonight, Six on Your Side reporter Molly O'Brien shows us the toll taken on those left behind. Jamie Wynn met Josh Scott at a previous job, the two of them striking up a friendship. He was like really jokingly with me and like, I don't know, he's really funny and we hit it off and we got really, really close. When telling us Scott was working the night of the crash at the Green Hills funeral home. He was working, he was at the funeral home. I think he was getting a body and he was on his way home. That day, he was supposed to come over to my house to see my sister's little girl because he always comes over there. And he was like, well, I can't. I got to work. I'll come over after. And I just never heard from him then after. Scott never made it to her house following his shift when learning the news of what happened on Sunday morning. My friend Austin called me and he was like, he just, well, I just woke up and he was like, Josh was in that wreck last night. And I was like, no way, you're lying. Like, I was like, no, you're lying. He wasn't. He was like, yeah, it was him. And I just burst it into tears. Green Hills Funeral Home posting a statement on Facebook reading in part, quote, Josh filled our funeral home with his love and compassion for serving others, his huge smile and entertaining personality. Scott described by his friend as someone who loved life. Just a very outgoing person, very laugh, laughter, very fun times all the time with him. Green Hills Funeral Home telling us that Scott was recently approved for an apprenticeship as a funeral home director and embalmer and had enrolled in mortuary school. In Union County, Molly O'Brien, WATE 6 on your side. Thank you, Molly. Tennessee Highway Patrol is in charge of this investigation.